What's going on YouTube? Tazbot here, back again with another Hearthstone video for you guys. We are going to be jumping into this week's Tavern Brawl. So we'll see what we get here as it loads. Tavern Brawls always seem to do this. They kind of have a latency to them. Okay, the Great Stone of Challenge. Welcome heroes to the Great Stone of Challenge. Your deck building prowess will be tested. You may only use spells with an even cost. You may only use minions with an odd attack. Okay, build the deck and fight for the Stone of Challenge. What is the Stone of Challenge and why are we fighting for it? Um, this may just be me being a noob, but I don't know. Okay, uh, we're going to go ahead and build our standard hunter, um, because there's a lot of odd attack. Um, spells that cost even, I don't know about. But, we can get our web spinners, we can get our explosive traps. Um, let's see, what else we got? We can do a multi-shot, which is pretty cool. Is it only showing me stuff that I have? Because I feel like there's stuff missing. No, because it's showing me these guys and I can't use them. We'll use our Haunted Creepers. We'll use an Anoyatron. So, I guess I haven't selected anything that I can't use yet. No, it's definitely showing me stuff that I can only use. Acolyte. Um, man, this is a lot harder than I thought it would be to think of stuff. We'll definitely go with our Burly Rock Draw. Okay, uh, we'll go with an Antique Heal Bot, Sludge, Lothab, we'll do a Grim Patron, see what we can get out of it. I mean, I don't really have any triggers in this deck, but we'll give it a try. We'll definitely use Emperor Thorzon. Um, we'll use a Stranglethorn. This is a lot harder than I thought. I can't use Fugin and Stalag because one of them has an even attack, because it's a 4-7. Dang it. Okay. Um, well, this is interesting. We'll use a Shattered Sun. We'll use a Northern Ring. I don't know. I'm kind of running out of things to use. We'll use that just in case. We'll get an Undertaker or two because we have some Death Rattle, but we don't want to build entirely Death Rattle. And I think Echoing Ooze. And one more. What was the other? Replace your hero. I've never actually replaced my hero with Ragnaros, so I don't actually know what it does. I've never had it happen either to me when I'm playing or against me, so we'll see what that can do. Again, this Tavern Brawl as a whole is kind of meh to me because of the... Um, I'm trying to think of how to say it. Because of the having to build a deck. Like, I don't know. I just think... You know, there's a lot of people working at Blizzard. They could be a little more creative. Although, the even and odd thing is kind of weird. We'll see what people come up with. I mean, I can't imagine... It, decks being that much different. Although, mine is. Mine's very different than what I would usually play. So, maybe it would be. I don't know. We'll see. We'll have to see what comes of it here. So... Yeah, sorry if I sound like a little weird. I did get back from a run, which, by the way, I hate running. Um, to me, it's like the least fun thing on the planet to do. But everyone does it because basically it's a, it's kind of a way to burn a lot of calories. So why not, you know? Okay. So I'm having some issues and I don't know why. Okay. So sorry about that. I had a few connection issues, but we're good now. Um, didn't really have a chance to look at this, although I did get a good curve, so whatever. I'm assuming that was actually waiting on me. I don't know why it showed it on him. But whatever. Doesn't bother me too much. So 
We're in here against Zingzatazazm. Whatever. What a piece of crap. Um. Okay. We'll throw down our echoing ooves and kill his flame imp, and we'll see what we can do about everything else. Not sure what really to do about the knife juggler because I don't have anything freaking good to deal with it. So we'll have to see. I don't really want to play my acolyte. I'll probably play. Okay. So that kind of works for me. Um, we'll play my shield master. Because if he wants to kill it with his minions on board, he's got to use them both. So we'll see if he does it. There's never any telling. But yeah, like I was talking about with running, like everyone hates it. Don't know why anyone pretends like they don't. But it's just awful and I don't I literally know zero people who enjoy it. So that's kind of my conundrum with the whole situation. Play that. This got off to a really unfortunate start with my cards. I haven't drawn my knife juggler and he's using his very effectively. And I could be using mine effectively, but I haven't gotten it. So we'll see what happens. Well, this is a bunch of shit unless I get my explosive trap and fast because I can't do anything. Well, this is all in the shitter now, so whatever. We must cleanse the sun well. He's literally, I think, like two away from lethal on board, something like that. So I guess what they're doing is a modified zoo lock sort of deck. I don't I don't really know. And because he's gotten these draws that he's gotten, he's doing pretty well with it. I mean he couldn't have asked for better draws and I couldn't have asked for worse draws, so whatever. <laughs> Good. Screw yourself. Although, 12... 13... He's like one off lethal. Yeah. And he can't get it. Yeah, good job. This is some bullshit. That was a bad start. Well so anyways, going back to where we were. We'll go ahead and queue up again and hopefully not get some crap like that where it was just god awful. I mean, like I said, it doesn't affect a lot of people and I guess Zulok would make a lot of sense because it's a pretty good rush. I tried to do a beast rush, but not even a beast rush, but a hunter rush. But I couldn't, I didn't, like, he got amazing draws. Like, I couldn't even get a foothold in that game. At least it was fast, but man, I couldn't even get a foothold to start with. So, and we're off to a, the exact same start this game. I can't, I can't play this stuff. Okay. This is interesting. Very interesting. I like it. We'll see if he can handle my early game rush, because I have a really good early game rush right now. I would assume he's going to play nothing. Fingers crossed, but I doubt it. He'll probably play something. Let's see what happens. He'll eventually decide. Okay, so... We throw down our knife juggler and let's see here what we get. Mm. 
Okay. Bring out your dead. Bring out your dead. So I'm actually going to do that, and then buff them both next turn, but he's probably got something that's going to deal two damage to everything, because he said well played. Okay, well... He didn't have it that turn. Okay, so we're just going to go full on face hunter at this point. We got really lucky with our draws. And we've gotten... Yeah, that was a rough start. I don't blame him. But hey, we got our win, so... That's pretty good. We got our pack. And we got a Druid or Hunter victory. Actually, we'll go ahead and knock this out. We'll play one more. It was a pretty short, especially that first game. Was pretty short, and that game was short. So let's see if we can get a match that lasts more than like... Hey, he got a good opening hand. I'm screwed. I'm out. Like, because that's not cool. No one likes that. So, we'll see here. We got a worthy opponent. So, Anaka. That's cool. If nothing else, I can throw down my Mad Bomber. But I got my... Undertaker, so that's a pretty good option. Hopefully I'll get something to back it up with. We'll see. We'll see. I would like to get a similar start to my last game, but who wouldn't? That's like the dream start. So, yeah, like I was saying, I, I got back from a run. I hate running. I think everyone hates running. I've met a few people that claim they like it, and I don't believe them. They're just dirty liars. So... Getting back into that sort of, you know, summer's coming. But the problem I'm having is it's been so rainy. Like, how am I supposed to, you know, go out and run when it's rainy and muddy outside? Because I don't like running on treadmills. I hate running on treadmills. I can never get my footing. You know what I'm saying? Like, it seems like it's never the exact right speed. Mm. So I like running outside where I can sort of run at my own speed and do my own thing. But, I mean not always capable, I guess, of doing that. What? He hero-powered to dagger? And then didn't use it? Okay. Well. Whatever. We'll just swing it in. We don't have anything good to play. So. Next turn we'll play our Acolyte, because if he's only got that one damage knife, or blade, then there's no point in you know. If he's only got that blade, then there's no point in doing anything but the Acolyte. Even with that, there's not really much point in doing anything more than the Acolyte. Because he's going to give me card draw. I don't know, we'll see what he does. I would imagine he's going to run that in. And if he does, then next turn I'll play my Bomber. Yeah. Blood and plunder. Not exactly what I wanted. Um. Wanna blow something up? <laughs> Bomber, you suck. But we'll see. Hopefully, he attacks in and kills everything. Because that's when you attack your hero, right? Explosive. Yeah. Okay, that was a choice that he made. And now I kill all his board, and we're back to square one. Well, sort of. Okay. He's running a rogue pirate deck? No. Surely not. Surely he's not running a rogue pirate deck. That would be really... Oh, he didn't have enough minions to fill it out. Okay. I know. I, I was there, dude. I wonder what he usually runs, because there's no way that's it. Does this do anything if you like hit him right in the order?
I wish it would like lift this hammer, or throw it or something. That would be awesome. But unlikely to ever happen. But that would be cool. Oh my gosh, I've never done this before. Okay, that's pretty freaking cool. That's pretty awesome. I'm not gonna lie. That's pretty sick. So now we're obviously gonna play our Emperor Thorazon and get some stuff for cheap. Because he's got at least this turn and probably next turn where he's gonna be a valid um, minion that he can't kill. Depending on what he plays here. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. I kind of don't want to kill it just to see what happens. Because if we get in a rush damage situation, I've got him beat. Because I've got lethal on the board right now. He doesn't. He's down to 8 and I'm at 29. So he's got to kill mine, giving me a one-step advantage. And he can't use a spell unless he wants to help my burly rock trog. We'll see what he does. This is an interesting move for him where he's at right now. This is I think he's stuck. But we'll see. He might pull out something pretty good. I like this one. This is the only reason I like this Tavern Brawl is it has variety. Because the, they didn't put such locks on you that you have to play a certain kind of deck and um, usually they do. Eviscerate, okay. Good job, good job, good job. Yeah, so that's what I like because when you go on ladder, it's full of like meta decks. And then if you go like arenas, that's why I like arena too. I like arena. Um, probably going to start streaming arenas more. I know I haven't been streaming much, but time limitations and whatnot with school and everything. So hopefully going to be able to start doing more. We'll see. What the heck? I didn't... Okay, so I didn't know that he had 8 health. I thought he was like um, the other one and had 15. Otherwise, I wouldn't have played him. At least not yet. But I don't know. I was kind of stuck. I didn't draw any good minions. I hate when that happens. I hate when I'm playing a game and the draws like either start off so good or they get so good but by the time they get good I'm screwed or they start off so good and then die and I'm just screwed I hate that but you know it happens it's part of the eSports part of you know Hearthstone that people like to rave about but you know it's part of every game like there's luck involved in every video game every sport everything there's luck involved so I don't get why people get so mad about it but they do. They do. They very much do. So we'll see what Hypnotica brings to the table. Hello. I'm I don't wanna emote all day with you. Like that's I wish I wish Hearthstone had like a permanent mute emotes. So you didn't have to do it every game, but they don't. Uh Yeah, this is unfortunate. He's going to buff that mana worm some more. He can only use one in whatever cost spells, though. Did you change your mind? 
Nope. Got him. So we'll see here. But I was talking about working out. I do like lifting weights. Probably because it's what I've always been best at, I guess. Not not like the best, like, oh, I'm the best weightlifter. No, like, it's what my body is most, um, what my body embraces the most. Running, my body hates, and it's like, the F are you doing? This is not fun. You know it's not fun. Why are we pretending it's fun? And running, it's just kind of used to it, so... Or lifting, I mean, it's kind of just used to it, and it knows that that's how things are going to go. So there's no point in complaining about it. But, yeah. It's what I've always been best suited to, I guess, is weightlifting. Um, you know, I was a lineman in high school and stuff like that, so... That's kind of where I become okay with that, is because of how that whole situation was and what I enjoyed about that was the weightlifting. So, hmm. We're kind of in a weird stalemate right now because he doesn't want my early rock jaw trog to be alive, but he also can't do anything about it. And I'm going to make him run his minions into mine. Because he has no alternatives. Let's see. I'm sorry. It's all good. I knew you were going to do it. I just wasn't going to give you the out. Do I want to restore three health? The problem is everything he's playing has three attack and Grim Patrons only have three. That's where I'm at right now. Engaging TC-130 Mental Dislocator! Well, you can have that. I didn't want it. <laughs> I would like my explosive trap, please. Please. Oh my god, and this person's so annoying. So, what are you gonna do about that knife juggler, huh? You gonna hit him with the spider and then ping him, or are you gonna hit him with one of those? Like, oh my god! Okay. Well, I'm screwed because I'm getting nothing worth anything so we'll play the grim patron even though we didn't really want to or need to but I have nothing better so whatever okay I'm already over you we get it you're being a prick so that didn't go well we're gonna keep going and get our one other hunter victory I mean, this deck is so dependent on getting the right draws in the beginning, like, I didn't get my web spinners the last, like, two games, I don't think. And I haven't gotten my Noitron very much, or my Explosive Traps. It's so dependent on draw, because of having to build a weak deck, because of the rules. But, that's the same reason that I said that I liked it before, was because it kind of gives you that randomness that you don't get out of ladder that a lot of people wish was there. Me, personally, I don't know if I wish it was there, um, because the level I play at it is there. Like, the lower levels, there's randomness. I don't play at Legend or anything like that. I don't grind it out like that. Mostly due to time. I would love to be able to sit here and grind it like that. I don't have the ability to. Um, I just don't have that kind of time. 
and like this isn't a full time thing for me like it is for a lot of streamers and pros and stuff like that mad respect to them they're doing their thing and it's awesome I wish I could I just don't have the ability to so with my time restrictions I can't get to that point and if you can't get to that point there's not there's it's kind of hard to justify a point to grind higher than 20 um, when there's no reward or anything for it. Are you kidding me, dude? Okay. We'll play that, and then we'll play this. And we'll leave it be. That's so cool that this sinks into that lava. I never knew that before today. I guess I've never seen anyone do it, or if I have, I've never paid attention to the people doing it. So, I think it's pretty cool. Yeah, but now you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to attack you with this one. And I'm going to feed you into that one. And then I'm going to play this. So we'll see what happens. I think I might have drawn two, or I might have put together too many one drop, or not one drops, one damage minions, um, because they. Hmm, So now what we're going to do is throw this down, and then we'll attack face. And we almost forgot our hero power, which would have bummed me out a little bit. So deep funk, let's see what he does. I hope he attacks a minion. I mean, I'm okay with him attacking a minion. Yeah, that's fine. We have gotten this combo pretty reliably, which makes the echoing ooze kind of worth it in a way that it wasn't before. But it makes it worth it in a way that it's not naturally. Yeah. So. I like upgrading these weapons because they can get pretty cool, I think. One time I sat and went through them all, and it was crazy. So much time wasted. What's, what's he do? Give your other minions 1-1. One, one. Mm. Well, dude, until you attack me, everything you do means nothing, so I'm kind of struggling with what to do right now. We'll see what he does. He's got to make killing the Trogzor a priority, but I can then kill his minions if he does that. If he doesn't life tap first, which he's getting pretty low to be life tapping, but he might. <laughs> I literally never knew this was a thing, and I didn't know it did more than just take the hammer away. Boom, hammer back. Okay. What are you going to do? You did a lot to come up with nothing so far. But. Dude, what are you doing? Let's see how he responds to the Gazrilla. Your 
thank you. Because I needed an Undertaker. Actually, it's one of the more useful one cost minions, so I guess it's hard to complain. Yeah, buddy, you better start swinging with some power. What? What? What are you doing? Are you? I don't know if he's ever going to swing at my face, or if he just plans to not do that. But I'm gonna keep hitting his. If I just hero power every turn, if he doesn't swing at my face, he's gonna lose. So he's ha he has to at some point. Cool story, bro. Yep. So he doesn't even have demons, but he's got a void terror. Interesting. Nope. Let's see what he does. Because I'm literally not sure at this point what he's going to do. <laughs> like, it's kind of weird playing some people when you don't understand how they're working. No, he's got demons. That's a death rattle. Duh. Okay, dude, make up your mind. So many possibilities. There are not that many freaking possibilities. Just do something. Jesus. Yeah, I'm dead. So, we're gonna get that one other win with this deck. I just need draws that don't suck, man. Okay, let's see if we can get our last win here. I'll be honest, I know the deck is pretty bad. It's pretty piss poor, but if you get the right synergy, like we saw it happen earlier, like, it steamrolls so bad that the person can't do anything. No matter what. No matter what their deck is, I feel like. So... I would really like to see that synergy happen again. It just hasn't happened yet. Is he a gold mage? Really? Well, screw me, man. Like, there's just... I'm gonna mulligan all that. Hopefully I can get that synergy that I was looking for. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, good, good. I didn't want it. Hopefully he plays something turn one and I can just throw down Mad Bomber. And he doesn't, so I can't. This person's probably going to wipe the floor with me, unless it's a bot. Um, because, I mean, let's be honest. <laughs> it's a gold. Let's see what he does. Something amazing, no doubt. I can fix anything. Hmm. 
We'll throw down our other ooze, see what happens. I mean, I don't know. I don't really have anything else to do with it, I guess, so why not? See if our ooze gang with our dire wolf can do some damage. No? Okay, cool. I didn't want to do any damage. Wait, let me attack first. And then we'll throw down our taunt. That way he's got to run into it, and we'll have it do us some extra damage. Let's see what happens now. I just don't want him to have less. Okay, so we're doing some damage to him. Hopefully preventing his plans. We'll see what happens. He's probably going to fireball. I don't know. I feel like his plan was to do something to my taunt. But maybe the Trogzor prevented that, or at least... If you control another mech, discover a mech. Oh, so it's a mech mage. It didn't seem mech mage. I guess he did play that turn one, but that was it, really. He didn't play too much other mech stuff. And I mean, I have 10, 11, so... Oh, I have to kill that immediately kill that. But I have the means, so it's okay. Bring out your dead. Bring out your dead. Let's see what happens now. Cause I'm genuinely curious because I genuinely have no idea what they're planning. Probably a flame strike, right? Flame strike? Flame strike, right? Flame strike? Oh, they can't play it. They can only play even spells, right? Yeah, they can only play even spells. That sucks. What you gonna do? Okay. That's a pretty good choice. But I'm still gonna kill that thing. Because I ain't got time for all that. Actually, yeah. Game finally got our last win. So let's go back here and we'll go ahead and we got our gold. As you guys know, I am doing um, my other series, which is playing through all the solo adventures. Completely free to play, so I do get on that gold grind sometimes. But anyways, we got our win, so let's open the pack up and see what we got. Ooh, epic. Avenging Wrath. Okay, I think I already had those. But yeah, that'll do it for me today. Thank you guys for watching. My Twitch and Twitter are in the description below. Please follow me there and let me know uh, what you guys think. If you would like to click like on this video if you liked it, click subscribe if you want to see more. And as always, I will see you guys next time.